So not too surprising out of H2K, uh, but there's a lot of different stuff out of SK here. Definitely the case. So we heard from SK in their press conference earlier today and Rater talking a lot about what SK needs to change up. They've picked different picks and bands. Hashtag SK win if you think it's going to be enough and if they can pick up their first win. Or hashtag H2K win if you believe in the team that beat SK in Madrid in the third place qualifier. Candy Panda is up on the wall. He was immortalized in the Berlin studio and he's back in the summer split. Have a look at that in a moment. Sven Skerin, he's going to tunnel his way into the bottom lane. He's looking for Oduam now. Oduam has actually started to overheat. The gank has been mirrored. Lulex, he body slams in. Candy Panda's down. Red buff is now ticking onto Enrated. A flash over the wall as Sven Skerin also gets a flash on Freddy. And Oduam there will go down to the cleaver of Freddy. Ever. Small advantage to Oduamne despite actually giving up first blood. Candy Panda he's found Kasink. Condemn could be a trouble. It does pin him against the wall. Candy Panda's gonna carry on chasing. Silver Bolt may be enough. We see Kasink going down. Candy flashes over. Silver Bolt proc will secure the kill. And we saw Svenskeren tunneling in, but that's a kill on the board for Vayne, despite being down. Big advantage. And it's all because Lulex was stood on a ward topside. They saw Gragas, and it meant that they could engage, but now Lulex goes in. No flash and nothing else to play with. I think Freddy's just going to get run down. 200 HP, 150, 110. Lulex is unable to secure it. The overheating Oduwamne. Level 6 is getting very close for both Oduwamne and Freddy. Oduwamne actually goes in before Freddy has access to Sadism. We do see Twisted Fate coming in with Destiny. He gates in, lands the wild cards, but there's the Sadism. And Freddy is just going to regen all of the damage he's taken. Oaked and annoyed by Hyanan and Kasink. Hyanan's now got a lot of time on that tower. While Sven Skeren stolen away the red buff. Lulix does not have access to the explosive pass and the support coming in from Oduwamne. Body slam comes over, but it hits a crud. That equalizer is not going to do a huge amount as Oduwamne. He gets flash engaged upon. Lulix still does not have access to his ultimate and Ryu with no destiny cannot respond quickly enough. Fox is chasing Ryu through the jungle and Lulix forced to flash away. Oduwamne, the man that we were praising, the man that we were saying has carried H2K in the last two weeks. have to time that really well. If you see uh, a Victor anywhere nearby, gravity field <laughs> on top of the gate of the Destiny is going to be so, so easy. Wow! Oh, here's Flash the Tibbers onto Candy Panda. The teleport comes in so, so early. Oduwamne is just there on the tri bush. Enrated gets barreled backwards. Ten minutes on the clock, H2K. Three members of H2K. Remember, there's no teleport. Teleport is coming from Freddy, though. Oh, no, I'm there. Freddy's coming in with sadism, and you can see Sven scaring around. Yon had managed to make it away. Kasing's going to be the first one to fall as Fox. Takes a lot of auto attack, so SK will be happy. Full engage everything forward mode. And uh, we're about there. We're about two minutes away. It would be very similar to what happened in our first game. Of, uh, of the Ryu's going up top actually is going to get the stuff. Well, we see gold card, we see ghost. Ryu is eating an infected cleaver, burning agony as well as that uh, masochism is doing work. Another gold card connects. Lulex force. He misses the barrel. Explosive cast doesn't connect. Ryu is looking to be in a little bit of trouble. <laughs> Not going to be enough for the kill. H2K throw everything in the kitchen sink just to kill Freddy's Mundo. And that death rate is doing a lot of work. Clearing out the wave, it has obviously been augmented. It's the hex port mark one. The only upgrade that he's secured just for the moment. Kasing is about to find himself between a rock, a hard place, and a queen of the Zersai. He's gonna land a stun, flashes over the wall. Candy Panda follows suit. He manages to grab himself a second kill. Lulix throws down the explosive cost. This time it hits. We do see Vayne using that passive to run in. Garnet under some pressure. Teleport coming out from Oduwamne. Sven Skeren eats a gold card. Now Oduwamne and Ryu trying to put damage down, but Oduwamne gives up his fourth death. Equalizer was burning down SK, but it just wasn't enough. And H2K. Uh, uh, pretty menacing at that point. Candy Panda was actually taking down the Rift Scuttler, but speaking of menacing, Oduwamne. He's gone. Two and five. The commentator's curse, or analyst <laughs> death curse, if you will. Tip and stun this time. We do see Enrated throwing down the monsoon. It keeps Candy alive for a few seconds longer. Enough to get Freddy to teleport in. Now Ryu, Yanan, and Kasing are trying to get away. On the hunt comes down, but Freddy is just sustaining himself through. Auto attack after auto attack. Oh. And the boomerang secures the kill. It took a long time, but it finally got done.
H2K one for two, and a tower to boot. A little while opted for that first rather than the Lich Bane because he knows as long as he gets a stun down onto Candy Panda, they can fight this. There's the equalizer. Ryu's gone in, he's forced to hourglass early. Fox is already down as the Chaos Storm continues to tick away. That's a flash defensively from Sunskiran. He tunnels into the river. Now Candy Panda's looking for targets. There's a few that are low, but H2K are split up. I think this plays into SK's favor. We see the Prey Seeker going out. Freddy is being focused down as Candy Panda comes over the wall, but he gets burned out by Oda One Day. We do see Freddy, he gets himself another. Another one as we see another kill picked up by Hyanan. This is messy and triple, I believe that was. At the end of it all, Hyanan 5 0 and 4. H2K peel away from SK's re engage. But that fight started on H2K's turns. It did, and H2K managed to get the better re-engage after SK tried to counter themselves. Uh, the damage dealers for H2K actually found themselves untouched and unfocused. Oh, Lulex is down. This is not going to be a Baron at attempt at H2K. And we did see Kasing for a moment there on your screen. He's actually got himself a Righteous Glory. Here's Ryu, Destiny goes out, he's gating onto Candy Panda, you can't stealth that. Very, very quick QSS as we see Candy Panda trying to get away, he's flashed for safety. In Raiders and Fox being focused down as Oduwambe does not manage to get on with the missiles. Now Freddy is in the middle of H2K, Ryu flashes Found over, again. wild cards and auto attack, manages to secure a kill. Gravity Field will not be stunning up Ryu, but we do see a burst down from the Luden's Echo as well. One for one at the moment, as we did see Candy Panda get dropped a moment or two ago. So H2K ends up winning the team fight, looking for more, unable to get it. But being a uh, one dragon away from what should win them a game, but that's an ultimate pop. And another time Candy Panda's on the side farming. Spin gets caught up by Tibbers. Gold card stuns him on the burning plate of Equalizer. Freddy's getting chunked down, he gets knocked back. Lulex lands a great explosive cask in H2K get two rapid kills before Candy Panda can even join his team. He just wants CS and he's not able to get it. H2K should be able to get Baron this time, though none of them are particularly low. However, Bottom Wave is pushing in towards them. Lulex actually is lower than I previously thought. SK may go for an engage, but they've got to match H2K. Wild Fox has got caught out by the gold card. Candy Panda oh. instantly gets peeled on. Five members of H2K land the poke down. Hyanan gets the auto attack before getting uh, condemned backwards. Fox in a rate to trying to get away. Fox managed to siphon the power of Lulex before the death ray burns through Hyanan's HP. Gravity Field will buy a little bit of time, and Fox may be able to get out alive starting to build tank from it from here. Uh, H2K even saved their ignite because they know Freddy can't survive. But speaking of Freddy not surviving, look at that! Everybody from SK is grouped together and H2K say, yes, please, we'll have a big piece. The explosive cast knocks Freddy back once more. And safety in numbers means H2K secure themselves. Two more kills. Performance. Baron is dropping low. It SK is. trying to come in from two sides. Sven Skirin wants to try. He got it! And he gets it! Sven Skirin with the hero play. Kasing's trying to get away, but Candy Panda will not. The kill is secured before Candy's dropped. And ends up being a one for one, but Baron's stolen. Freddy to counterbalance the weaker Candy Panda. And you can see that boomerang did a lot less than it has been doing. Ryu's gonna go though. Wow, Freddy is being melted down. Auto attack after auto attack, crit after crit. Tibbers comes onto Fox's Lulex. is gonna knock him against the wall. Monsoon's gonna split up the team fight, but it's H2K with the advantageous numbers. Ryu unable to survive the exchange as Freddy is still taking away. He's surviving. Hyanan has got a full HP bar and a bloodthirster to boot. He takes down one, he takes down two. And a two for four. As H2K regain control, we weren't sure how he was going to do it, if he was going to do it, but he's proving that he can. Dragon has been started, stressing oh, through it. Candy. Candy Panda is down. We see Fox following. SK were late to the party. They were greedy for the Dragon, and they give up their lives. Oduwamne is angry, and he wants revenge. He punishes Sven Skeren for focusing his lane. And four more kills as H2K look to end the game. Oh, and at the end of the game, SK are focused on Dragon so much that H2K, yes, they gave them Dragon after Dragon after Dragon the entire game, but H2K have just out team fought SK and are pushing for the win. In a 42-minute epic, H2K are pushed harder than they've had to all split long. They secure themselves the win against SK, 
And that was by no means an easy task. And we can see some of the relief on the players' faces.